you. Hi, it's good to see you again. What brings you to Washington? Well, I, I had an opportunity to come here for some meetings, uh, but I had also the opportunity to just brief the president for about 15 minutes on the sniper. But I can tell you that the cooperation, I will tell you that those threats remain. We continue to educate our forces and all of the other NATO and non-NATO forces in these dangers. Uh, we try to do that virtually every day. Not only that, we are trying to educate the people of Bosnia, particularly to the mine threat, using the internal communications capabilities that we have. But we continue to educate our forces and all of the other NATO and non-NATO forces in these dangers. So the bottom line right now, as far as war criminals are concerned, if I4 comes upon a war criminal, what happens? But I've said before, uh, our people are going to attack without warning. I mean, without warning, we will do that. Well, I'd spoken to President Clinton about that when he was in Kusma, and I think he and I agreed on what I4's mission is and what we would be able to give. <clears throat> what I gave him today was an update.